Hi, my name is Sam Dhanishekaran and welcome to this video series of database lessons. In this lesson, we will talk about what is a file system. Let me try my best to explain this with an analogy. Let's just say you want to store your stuff. You then approach a storage company. They have a vast field where they have built a nice warehouse which was divided into nice little sections with an area for loading and unloading and a nice reception etc. So let me try my best to draw a reception okay okay and then let me try to draw a warehouse entrance and it's a nice warehouse so it has cubicles sections etc okay so what happens if you want to put your stuff in there you will drop them in the loading area let's say there is a loading area here so you drop your stuff here okay then the warehouse people the storage people they will move those stuff inside and then you would do the same thing to pick up your stuff they would pick up your stuff and put put those in the loading or unloading area and then you go and pick them up so basically what happens is this place is kind of used like a buffer and since they have it formatted with a lot of partitions and everything they would give you a flexibility of storing different kind of storage uh, objects okay when I say objects don't take in a literal meaning I know this analogy may not be an hundred percent fit to explain this but then you know I hope you would get the idea okay basically the the point is they take up a, a raw vast field and then they partition it like that they format it by building this nice uh, storage area which is divided into nice little sections and they help you to fetch and put the stuff in there and they have this little bit buffer area okay so so in some cases this would be far better than you just having a plain field and having to store your stuff without all these warehouses warehouse structure right a file system is somewhat like that once a hard disk is connected to a computer the OS can create a file system in there which would enable applications running on that OS such as an Oracle database to store files in that file system this way the applications have to go through the buffering systems of OS to access its files advantages better file management because the file system will take care of it and it's easy to maintain in case if there is an issue uh, the administrators the system administrators or the database administrators would be able to go to uh, wherever the files were uh, stored and look into what happened okay disadvantage it could be slower than the, the raw device because uh, the Oracle database has to interact uh, through the buffer uh, which is owned by file system and also there could be some compatibility issues like that um, so this is what a file system is and Oracle can store files in a file system too thank you